The average American eats nearly 56 pounds of beef in a year, according to the market research firm Packaged Facts. That means to keep up with the growing demand for beef, the men and women who raise cattle must find ways to do it more efficiently. That's why part of the recent Louisiana Farm Bureau Livestock Advisory Committee's beef tour focused on research. This is the sale barn at the Oklahoma National Stockyards. It is the world's largest stocker and feeder cattle market and one of the favorite stops for those on the Louisiana Farm Bureau Livestock Advisory Committee beef tour. This is where they see the value they've raised in their cattle. Livestock Advisory Committee Chairman Marty Woldridge says this is a good place for those on the tour to see the entire landscape of the cattle industry. We're showing them things that is anything and everything about the cattle industry in this state so that it's getting them to think about a new idea or what makes Oklahoma cattle industry that what it is. That's what this facility set up for. At the Noble Research Institute in Ardmore, Oklahoma, these farmers and ranchers learn about the Integrity Beef Program. We wanted to take something where we implemented all the best management practices that were available in the industry and be able to help a producer ultimately at the end of the day uh, make a bigger profit. Robert Wells is a livestock consultant with the Noble Research Institute. He makes it very clear that profitability for those who raise cattle is good for the consumer. We view it as a win-win relationship. It's telling people, buyers, that producers are doing these things, uh, that it's expected of them from terms of a, a genetic selection, uh, a breeding program, uh, to a herd health program, to a backgrounding program. Uh, how they are uh, developed and how they are raised. Uh, they, all producers have to be BQA certified. And so it's educating the, uh, these Louisiana producers just on that program and that there's opportunities out there. Watching what the Noble Institute did, some of the research they're conducting, that's so relative to farms like our own in terms of soil nutrients and herd health management and the efficiencies that frankly after the past two winters we've been striving to improve. If Ryan Walker looks familiar, you've seen him here on Twyla before. Walker used to conduct cattle research at the LSU Ag Center Hill Farm Research Station in Homer. His role is a little different now. He's working more on the extension side than research, but says it's an interesting new challenge in his career.